Hi, my name is Tom McGrath and I'm the course coordinator for the accounting and finance degree. I also teach some accounting modules and all the tax modules on the accounting and finance degree. So today I'm just doing a short little message for you just to uh, give you an idea of what's on the course and maybe if it's a course that you might think is the one for you. Years one and two, we do a lot of sort of general business students like in that, and there will be sort of theory and some computation. But when you move into years three and four, a lot of the subjects do have a fair bit of computations in them. So you would need to be reasonably comfortable working with maths. You also need to be prepared to work hard in college. You know, the students we've got who have worked hard on this course have done very well. Uh, so you do, you do need to prepare to work hard in college. And I suppose you need to recognize as well that this is a long course in that if you want to become a professional accountant, then after your four year degree, you need to do a further three years to become a professional accountant. So, you know, you need to be prepared to stay in there for quite a while. There's no problem. You can finish with your four year degree and work as a part qualified accountant as well. And many of our graduates do that. You know, they might move into working in banking or in finance or insurance or even working as a trainee accountant in firms. You know, so you don't have to become a professional accountant. But if you want to earn the big money, then you need to sit your professional accountancy exams. Uh, when you leave here with your four-year degree, four degree, the accounting and finance degree has very good exemptions with the professional accountancy bodies. So you don't have that much study to do when you leave, but you do need to enter into a three-year contract usually to get your experience before you become a professional accountant. You don't have to have done accounting in secondary school. Uh, many of our students have not done accounting in secondary school, and that's not a problem. We start at a very basic level in accounting, so there's no problem with students who have never done accounting before. So what are the benefits then for you if you choose the accounting and finance degree? Well, if you choose to do the accounting and finance degree, your job prospects on leaving here are very good. Uh, the job market for accountants at the moment is good and the accounting and finance students are very well regarded by employers. Uh, we have very good progression rates. Uh, the students who start in year one, most of them make it all the way through to year four. So we've been lucky that we've got some very good students on the course and we uh, academically our students have done very well and we've managed to keep our students from year one to year two to year three and year four and the graduate here with their honours degree in accounting and finance. Uh, you're not at all restricted to just working in accounting when you leave here. Uh, you will have an accounting and finance degree which is a business degree so you can go into working as a trainee manager or various other jobs in different organisations. Uh, I suppose a lot of people think that accountants are pure number crunchers. That's probably the financial accounting role and when you're doing your training that's a lot of what you may be doing. But later on uh, you can move into various roles and most, most accountants move into management or something like that. But they're not usually number crunching for the rest of their days. And just to give you an idea of some accountants we'd say who are doing quite different things. Uh, we'd say the former Taoiseach from the 1980s, he is a chartered accountant. The Minister for Finance in the same period was also a chartered accountant. Uh, the operating guy who's running Ryanair at the moment is Michael O'Leary. He originally started out as a tax accountant. Uh, some other somewhat famous accountants who are doing very different roles would be uh, John Grisham, who's a very well-published crime author. He did an accounting and finance degree in college. Mick Jagger, the lead singer with the Rolling Stones, did an accounting and finance degree in college. And uh, slightly more infamous than famous would be John Delaney, who was the director of the uh, Football Association of Ireland. He also qualified as an accountant. So there's plenty of roles out there for you. Uh, they're not necessarily all number crunching. Uh, you just need to be prepared to work hard and an accounting career can be very rewarding.